vi the vision for the, the cathedral is, um, and a vision statement is forging our future uh, and winning the culture with the gospel. So that's kind of a, the, the vision statement. What we're really doing is, is building a Christian culture in the midst of a very secular culture. So the, the unique vision of, of Intercessor, or our purpose is to uh, minister to those families in Nassau County. So it's a family community. And with the message of the gospel, which will build strong families. I think it's a great place for families too. The bishop and everybody at the church really includes kids and young adults in with, with the worship and with the with the word. First and foremost, the, this church is called to forge the future um, of future generations. And by that, we mean that we need to invest in the next generation, um, not only because they're the future of the church, but they are the church present as well. And so we put a high value on children and uh, young adults in this church, and we treat them uh, with respect and um, believe that God has plans and purposes for them, even as children and, and young adults. I was raised in a Christian family, but I had never come to a church so different, and it just seemed to feel right to me. Just the word was so was so powerful every week, and the worship was so good, and it was just very different, and it always just felt like home to me. You should expect to come to church and hear the gospel preached and uh, with fire. You should expect people to be joyful in their praise of God, and you should expect to receive the sacraments. Here's what God has used throughout the ages, oil, bread, wine, water, to dispense grace to his people. God uses the material to convey the spiritual that the divine touches the common. I'm really blessed to be a part of this church community. Um, I see it as a, uh, a community of love and support. And you hear words like excited, joyful, accepting, um, caring, you know, from, from the very, from walking through the door. It's really, it's really a blessing. It's like a home away from home. Uh, I feel very welcomed here. Church of the Intercessor has really helped bring out my gifts and, uh, and my spirituality, helped me um, become my own man and, you know, and uh, I'm not just coming with my parents, I actually want to come and I enjoy, I enjoy coming to church. It's fun, I mean, it's not, you, you think of church and you think going and sitting down, standing up, and it's boring, but it's actually not. You know, the, the music they play, you know, it's upbeat, it's fun, and, uh, and Bishop Craig is very funny. You know, you, you can't sit through a service and not laugh, um, and you learn a lot. It is a joyful experience. In John chapter 4, Jesus tells us, that the Father is seeking those who would worship Him in spirit and in truth. The truth part of it is that uh, obviously we want to worship according to what the Word of God teaches us. And in spirit, He wants us to worship from the heart, that our, our, our worship would be sincere from our heart. And I believe an intercessor here, that's uh, the ethos of our worship, that we believe that God is to be praised in good times than bad no matter what. We're a worshiping church that is uh, filled with thanksgiving for the love and mercy God has shown us. We're family. I mean, um, we're the family of God. Um, we're, the, we're the sons and daughters of a father. And, and God is gathering us 
and we hold family and life. All life is sacred. <laughs>